Hey guys, in today's video, I want to share with you guys my personal favorite new changes and features that Apple made to iOS 12. These are going to be some features that I find myself using a lot and are very useful. Let's begin. Now, this first one is more of a time saver, and it's kind of funny that I'm mentioning this one because it's just so simple, going back to basics. If you have an iPhone 10, you'll understand iOS 12, iOS 11. If you swipe up for the app switcher and you want to quit an application, you can't just simply swipe it away. You have to go app switcher, tap and hold, then quit, right? It's just a long process to quit an app. Right here, iOS 12, simple change, just makes it very, very useful and less time consuming. Here's a really cool feature that Apple added in combination with AirPods under Control Center. It's called Hearing Aid. When you put the AirPods in your ear and activate Hearing Aid, you can enhance the audio coming in through live listening option available in iOS 12. So if you're watching TV at night and there's someone maybe sleeping next to you and the TV's really low, you use this feature because then you can enhance the audio with your AirPods in your ear and listen to the TV while it's really, really low while not disturbing the other person. I have a dedicated video for this. It's an amazing feature of iOS 12 in combination with AirPods. Pretty cool one. Now in iOS 12 on their password and accounts, there's a new feature built into iOS 12. If you would like to share a password with maybe a family member or a friend for maybe a Netflix account or a Amazon Prime account, and you wanna share this without having to say the password, if you go under the passwords account settings here, I created a fake account here uh, with the New York Times just to demonstrate this feature. You can now tap and hold and you can airdrop that username and password to the other person without having to say a word. And now they can log into whatever account it is that you allow them to. Now this next one is a time saver and I love when Apple does this and improves the user experience. Right there from control center on the lock screen, 3D touch on notes, scan a document right then and there, quick. I don't have to unlock my device, go into notes and actually find the scanning option. Now this next feature, I didn't think I would like it as much as I do, but it's quickly becoming one of my favorites and it's Siri shortcuts. Now this really turns Siri into a more personalized experience because you can create custom phrases to do custom actions for you. So if I say favorite radio station to Siri, it automatically knows to play ESPN News Sports. That's it. So it's just so cool because you can really just customize Siri and personalize the experience with Siri shortcuts. It's quickly becoming one of my favorite features. Now this one has got to be one of my top favorite features. I know it's something so simple, but if you go to log into your bank account or anything that requires a two-factor authentication where you get a text message with a verification code to autofill this right here is just so simple and so useful that I've been using it every day since I've had iOS 12 to log into bank accounts and to uh, authorize two-factor authentications with emails and things like that. It's just so, so well thought out. Now this last one is an application that's gonna be measures. Now this application is unique to iOS 12 and it's very, very useful. It allows you to take measurements and augmented reality is just really, really cool. And I find myself using it a lot. So I hope you guys enjoy uh, this video. Some of the things that I love, some of the new features and changes of iOS 12 that are just really, really cool. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.